Hello fish keepers. I decided to make a short video on how I clean my fish tank and how I saved a ton of money on my equipment. So here we go. I spent $44 as opposed to 99 by buying all my things separate instead of getting the Python kit. I bought the gravel tube for $12.99. I bought the aquarium pump for $8.42. The adapter that goes with my specific sink garden hose for ten dollars and a valve switch for 670. remove your aerator put on your adapter put on your aquarium pump attach your hose your gravel tube in there pump water comes into here through this into the filter media into here where it gets pumped back into the tank i have an off switch so i'm going to turn that off come back to the sink open the valve make sure your sink is clear to turn on the water and start siphoning well the water is siphoning you can use the siphon to suck up any debris in the gravel. Brushes and sponges to clean the sides of the tank with. The bucket comes in handy, no water on the floor. Taking out as much water as I want, so I'm gonna go turn off the water now. Turn off. It's gonna still siphon a little, so I'm gonna go turn off the valve switch. I don't want it to siphon anymore, so valve switch off. I'm doing a deep clean today, so I'm going to take off the piping to my hang on the back filter. And even this little thing that siphons the water out, I'm going to scrub it. I've reattached everything I need to attach and now I'm going to replace some of my filters not all of them because I don't want to mess up the beneficial bacteria so in here I have these sleeves I'm gonna take them out and replace them with new ones and in a week I'm going to take out the um the filters in my hang on the back filter just spread them out a little bit so you don't disrupt things too, too much. Because I have a sump, there's a ton of beneficial bacteria in here anyway, and I don't do anything with that. I leave that alone. So everything should be good. Refill. Open the switch. Get the water temperature the way you want. Close this valve. The water is now running to the tank. Glorious! Just keep an eye on it. You don't want to overflow it. Don't forget your water conditioner like I almost did. Take out the tube. Drain it into the sink. Decided to throw everything out the door. Tank is primed. Everything's ready to go. I'm going to turn on the switch and pray everything starts working. So far, so good. The tank is finished. Not gonna lie, it's a lot of work, but they're worth it. Hope this helped. Bye!